hello welcome back to my channel so we're doing something a little bit different today so i just saw that they released a second trailer for fantasy life i so i wanted to do like a reaction video to it and we could like do some like discussion and talk about everything that's in it so i literally i have not watched it so hopefully we get a, we're getting a release date um with this this trailer so there also is one for professor layton so i feel like i might do a separate video for that but before i get started my name is delaney i love talking about video games just over here chilling in this corner of the internet so if you like that kind of thing like and subscribe and let's get to it y'all so yeah we're gonna get right into it ドラゴンの化石に導かれ、たどり着いた謎の島で冒険者たちを待ち受ける者とは。助けた少女がいた国はすでに滅びた。千年前の王国だった。ライフと呼ばれる十四種の職業を習得したら。I'm so excited for this。制作職で、制作や料理を作って準備を整えたら。島探索に出発。冒険で見つけたロボットの力も借りれば拠点の地形を変えるのも簡単。自分好みに飾り付けて、垂れた島を復興しよう。木こりで木材を集めて大工になって家具を作ったら、マイハウスもコーディネートできる
so excited for this oh i cannot okay so first so at the at the top it says new features we have open world exploration new movement options which it looks like with the new movement options that you get to climb um because and also you get to swim in the river which is something that you couldn't do in the original fantasy life if i can recall um we got island customization which i think is pretty cool because i kind of feel like this is going to fill that hole i felt about animal crossing like after like completing my island and everything and i've wanted to find a game that has that same kind of like gives me the same feelings that i get playing animal crossing you know i feel like this is gonna be it let's see we have the gathering strangelings we have new player actions there's the new lives which we already knew farmer and artist which i'm just really excited i do feel like it looks like it's gonna be a little bit easier to switch between the lives like from how they're saying it i know before you'd have to go to like the guild office to change your life i'm wondering if it's gonna be something more smoother where where you can kind of do it while you're out and about um let's see we have story mode there's an avatar creation let's see familiar faces from the series which i have been noted i have noticed they have some characters that were in the original fantasy life games that look like they are the strangling um we got crafting which is town planning building your own house you got islanders houses islanders houses so you get to bring people to the island guild houses you're building the present island building infrastructures object placement plushings shop plushings cafe redesigning buildings and development missions so we got multiplayer up to four player co-op two player family co-op which i think is really awesome oh gosh free exploration slash random dungeons in multiplayer wow so okay so it looks like it's gonna maybe be on other platforms but i feel like it's gonna probably be a nintendo switch exclusive for now but i'm seeing it says other platforms undecided which makes me feel like it probably would end up on other probably i feel like steam it probably might, might be on pc i feel like that would probably be an option but you guys i'm really super excited for this so april 2025 let's have our fingers crossed that we actually releases at that time i think that this has been really cooking like i really think it has been baking in the oven the developers have really been taking their time with this and i think this is going to be something good like i can feel it like just from watching the trailer other than like you know i'm a fantasy life fan but uh, i just am so excited you guys okay you guys let me know in the comments what you think of the trailer what are you excited to see coming to fantasy life i'm really excited for this multiplayer co-op i'm really excited for that actually um but yeah let me know down below thanks for watching this video and uh have a wonderful day bye you guys